Let us know how logarithms are used in real life. Usage of logarithms is in calculations of engineering, science, business, economics and also in calculating compound interest. Logarithms are used for all sort of calculations in engineering, exponential growth and decay, pH value in chemistry, measurement of the magnitude of earthquakes etc. Before going to learn about logarithms, we need to recollect loss of exponents. This is because logarithms and loss of exponents are closely related and in order to understand logarithms, a good knowledge of loss of exponents is required. For example, in the given expression 4 is called the power or exponent, 3 is called the base. We know that any composite number can be expressed as product of powers of prime numbers. Suppose we want to multiply 27 with 81. One way is to multiply both the numbers directly. The other way is to use the rules of exponent. The product of 27 and 81 can be written as 3 power 7 according to the laws of exponents as shown on screen. Similarly, if we want to divide 81 with 27, we obtain the number 3 as per the loss of exponents. Therefore, for replacing multiplication with addition and for replacing division with subtraction of numbers in exponential form, logarithms are necessary. Now, let us know what a logarithm is. Writing exponents as logarithms. For example, 10,000 can be written as 10 power 4, where 10 is the base and 4 is the exponent. So, writing a number in the form of a base raised to a power is known as exponentiation. We can also write it in another way called logarithms as log 10. 10,000 can be written as 4. This is stated as log base 10 of 10,000 equals 4. Thus, logarithmic form is expressed as shown. General case, if a power n is equal to x, then logarithmic form of it is, is log x to the base a equal to n, where a and x are positive numbers and a not equal to 1. Similarly, the exponential form of log x to the base a equal to n is a power n is equal to x. Example, the logarithmic form of 2 cube is equal to 8 is shown on the screen. Now, let us solve a sample problem on logarithms.